Displayed in the map is an IFC model of a universal beam. Flicking to the camera view of an SX10 or SX12 is a physical model of that same beam. What I'm going to do next is an object oriented setup and bring my model, my IFC model, in terms of my physical model. So I'm basically going to do a resection off the physical model and transform that IFC model into terms of that. So here we can see I've got a line 5 mils in around the edge of my model and I'm going to snap to the corners of that and on the physical model I've also got positions marked 5 mils in from the corners as well. So I'm going to shoot to those with, uh, in DR mode and Observation I'm going to work my way around the four corners of the object effectively doing a resection off those four points. First I pick the location in the IFC model I want to measure to and then I zoom to the same location in the physical model and measure to that and I do that um, Observation stored. at least three times as I work my way around the model in this case I'm going to do fourth a fourth point and having done that I will have resected off that physical object I will have the instrument location um, determined based on that object um, the z-axis of the instrument is no longer vertical it will be based off that surface um, that I've just measured to and the IFC model will story. be transformed and positioned um, on top of the physical model. So here we're measuring our fourth point. Out of tolerance. And observation stored. You can see our resection results and the coordinates of our station point, which we are now storing. Station setup completed. And now when we zoom out a little bit and flick to the camera view we can now see the IFC model um, superimposed over the physical model and the slider down the bottom lets me change the transparency. So now I'm going to go and do a scan of that model so I'm just selecting my scan area starting the scan and then what I'm going to do next is I'm going to just um, isolate the scan points from the top of the model and then work with those. So our scan, scan is complete. now complete I'm just going to rotate the model so I can see it edge on and we'll zoom in a little bit just to that top and then I can, once we've zoomed in, I will drag a selection box and here we will see I'm just selecting the scan points that are hitting the top of that um, universal beam. I'm saving that as a region and now when I go into layers I can switch the scan off and just have that region switched on. So now I've just isolated all those scan points I'm not interested in. Got rid of those. Now what I want to do is a surface inspection. Um, so I'm going to select the surface that I want to inspect against. I'm going to switch on the scan points and then we're going to go into um, surface inspections. And now we're doing a surface inspection between the top surface of that universal beam and those scan points. And those are our results. And so we can see from the colour shading that our results are within a couple of mils and we can actually tap on those points and see those numbers displayed on the right hand side. So that's a very quick overview of what you can do with object oriented setups, um, IFC files and uh, surface inspections. Thanks for watching.